Hey everyone, Fierce Technology Review here. Um, so what I've got right now is the brand new BlackBerry Bold 9900 and I've got the BlackBerry Torch 9800. Um, these, this is basically the newest, great, latest, greatest device from uh, RIM. Um, it's got the uh, brand new touchscreen on there um, as well as it's got that full keypad for you. Um, quite noticeably right away you can tell it's much thinner of a phone. Um, I'll do a little bit of physical comparison. I mean you can see how much thicker the uh, Bolds, um, or sorry, the torch is compared to the bold. Even with uh, this out there, I mean, you can see it's quite a bit thicker. It's, I mean, it's it's almost half the thickness of the uh, torch itself. Um, obviously, you can look those stats up if you want to see directly. But I'm just going to give you a quick rundown. Um, one thing you can see uh, with the the new. Um, um, bold is it's definitely a lot faster of a phone. Everything just runs a lot smoother. Um, when you're on the torch, you can definitely see it's it's slightly laggy when you're going through a little bit of things here. So um, that's definitely noticeable. But um, I'm going to do a little bit of browser test. The main thing between um, these two new phones is that obviously BlackBerry OS 7 is running on the Bold 9900, and uh, on the torch we've still got it on 6.0. Or OS 6. Um, so I'm going to pull up the web browsers here and I'm going to give you a comparison here. Um, I'm going to go to a popular site which a lot of people who are Blackberry fans will use is uh, crackberry.com. So go crackberry.com on there and we'll go on to this one as well and we'll go crackberry.com. So uh, both these phones right now are running on my same Wi-Fi network. Um, so uh, I'll just just show you browser-wise. Um, see how nice and smooth this is. This it's quite smooth, but it's uh, it doesn't give you as much of a flick. It's a little bit laggy. Um, and I'll show you this as well. It's got the pinch to zoom, but you notice already was a little bit of checkering on there. Um, that's something, there it is, there's that checkering. That's something that the uh, the new Bold you can definitely see has improved on. It's very, very quick of a web browser. Um, the pinch to zoom and all that, it's very comparable of a web browser now to um, the iPhone 4 and as well as any of the newer Android devices. So um, BlackBerry is finally I'd have to say has got it with their web browser now. Um, that was kind of the one thing that was a little bit lacking with their phones. Um, I'm a huge BlackBerry fan myself. I, I hate to knock them, but uh, definitely browser experience has improved a lot on the new OS 7. They're launching a ton of new devices out right now. Um, so, I mean, you're going to see a bunch of new phones from BlackBerry as well using this OS 7. Um, anyways, um, another thing I'll tell you about this phone also is it does have uh, the 5.0 megapixel camera, same as the Torch. Um, but it also has um, 1080p HD video, um, which is another thing that the... Um, the Blackberries uh, were lacking for a while was the HD video, but now it does have that HD video, so definitely awesome. Um, I'm not going to go into too extensive details because, to be quite honest, there's not a huge, huge difference between the operating systems. There's a few more customizable features and stuff, but um, I've had the phone, the Bold 9900 now for a couple of days, and I absolutely love it. Um, I have noticed battery life not as great as I thought it would be, but uh, that's definitely something that's probably going to improve with software software updates as well as um, it could be even I have a defective battery I don't know um, but uh, definitely stay tuned I'm gonna have a lot more reviews and comparisons I'm gonna do the um, iPhone 4 review between the two phones I'll go a little bit in more details onto the phone so there you have it uh, Bold 9900 and Torch 9800 as well thanks guys